Uh, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. I just got done awarding some medals, and I'm out like candy. Went to the officer training school. We've upped our squad size by one, so we're gonna send another fine man or woman into the breach, possibly being murdered. It's an exciting time ahead of us. Let's get some more soldiers in there. It sounds to me like we're gonna need them. Let's see what the world has in store. I am the Conquista Dork. Thank you for joining me as we make our way through XCOM Enemy Within. Beam weapons have begun. Excellent. So we're going to start being able to manufacture some laser pistols and some laser rifles. Yeah. Nice weapons to have. Let's start doing some autopsies because I've got some bonuses. The tall that apply one has, to that. up until this point, been unofficially referred to as the Thin Man. Initial testing has revealed a concerted effort by the aliens to modify this specimen's genetic structure in such a way as to make it appear human. However, on closer inspection, we seem to have had some trouble concealing the eyes, which appear to be reptilian in nature. Also, the haircut is a dead giveaway. So there's that. Soldiers, here we go. Germany, are you in trouble again? We're here to help. All right, new rookie in town. We got two of them. Over here, rookie Gwynny Pig. Wonderful cosplayer. Met her out at uh, Nerdicon last year. Lovely doll. She does some live streaming. You should check her out. On the other side, we have the rookie Tim Reynolds. Glorious soldier. Well versed in combat. Stage combat. He's a, he's a director and a writer. Fantastic gentleman. Let's hope he doesn't die. Anyway. Someone. I'm going to. You know what? Miss Pig. How about. Uh, we're gonna hand the arc thrower over to you. In the meantime, we don't have a support person, so this is gonna be fun. Because Miss Rachel is currently getting patched up. That might or might not be my fault. I'm not gonna admit uh, my part in it. Strike one. Prepare for landing. Nor will I deny it. Our target site is near the German border. Reports indicate the UFO is set down in a sparsely populated area. We need to stay sharp and eliminate the invaders. All right, we're going to go inside of a UFO today. That'll be fun. Of course, I might have wildly uh, misinterpreted the definition of the word fun by saying that, but you know what? HQ, this is Big Sky. Cool. We're in position and awaiting further orders. Roger that, Big Sky. Strike one, you are green to deploy. Approach with extreme... Oh, caution. I didn't waste any time today, did ya? The site is unknown. Okay. Good start. We're off to a very good start. Target still in play. I know. I know, I saw. I really appreciate you pointing it out, though. I think that was very generous of you. Oh yeah, let's go for him then. Nice shot! Maybe that could be one we'll do a little arc throwing at. Aye, aye, Commander. Or just blow him the fuck up at this point. It doesn't really matter all that much. Okay. Oh, Tim, welcome to the team. Welcome to the team. You are so far almost as effective as basically all of us, so... Mazel tov. On my way. I think what we might need next is another, uh, robot. <laughs> or, or maybe more soldiers that will survive you know, a couple of missions. Because we've got some people who are doing fine. 
Fine, nothing. They're doing great. But otherwise, everyone else seems to be dying on me. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm wording it like it's your fault. Uh, guys who are dying. Ew. All right, cock diesel. Do that. Yeah, all right. Fuck that guy. All right, Miss Pig. We're gonna... Double time. Yeah, do our best to get you in there. Uh, I really want to On get this one alive. So I'm gonna try and distract that dude with uh, some nice giant robot tail right out in the open. Everyone okay. else can reposition. Feel good about themselves. Yeah, it's this stuff. Heading to that location. Let's see if this works. Hostile targets driven to withdraw. Yeah, not at all. Not even close. <laughs> that, was, that was fucking terrible. Okay. That's affirmative. Yeah, thank you for agreeing. Chemistry location confirmed. I appreciate that. That looks like the primary power source for the alien craft. I could only hazard a guess as to the amount of power it would have to be generating to propel that ship. Lots. I'd watch your fire down there. That equipment could be highly unstable. I hope so. I'm gonna shoot at it every chance I get. Yeah, fuck you. We were gonna Alabama. take you alive, but then you had to act like an asshole. Alright, everyone, slog it through this horrible pond water. You're probably not getting any diseases. Got it. Moving. We, we survived the alien invasion, only to die from trench foot. 10 4. Those are my favorite numbers. Oh my god, I don't feel good about that. Why did I make that joke? I apologize, ladies and gentlemen. You deserve better than that. Or maybe you don't. Maybe you don't deserve better. You might be murderers and thieves and rapists and you know, message board trolls. You might be the scum of the earth, for all I know. And I'm just going to assume that you deserve better than that when you very well may not. No. No. I'm sorry, ladies and gentlemen. You're not gonna fool me into feeling that way, no sir. Not this fellow. Mm -mm -mm. It's been secured. Thanks. Alright, get ourselves some milled. Miss Pig, okay. if you wouldn't mind uh Target acquired. Popping up there. Hey! Look at you! Uh, you being the most inexperienced member of this team so far are going to be expected to zap that thing when it gets too close. Congratulations on that one. Although, Christ, I still got to build a containment field, don't I? Yeah. This thing through, aren't I? ET in sight. Engaging. Target still up. I know. Couldn't help but notice when he shot at him, he didn't die. Going to die. Heading out. Nailed him. Good. Just because I am a robot doesn't mean I can't enjoy some of the local vernacular. Good to go. Do you dogs hear what I am talking about? 
That is frickety, frickety, frickety fresh. There we no go. longer need ammo. Understood. Moving out. This is uh This is good. I'm glad that I am putting two of our rookies right up in front. What did I tell you about not learning from my uh, lesson? My le not learning my lesson? Adjusting not learning from my mistakes? People are dying here, Phil. People you know. Jesus Christ. Okay, so Tim ain't dead. Not yet. If we can get him out of here in time, because I don't have a support person. They're moving to flank me. I think he's got two, maybe three rounds. For the love of God, get me out of here. Aye, aye, Commander. I'm working on it. That, you know what? <laughs> Running back that way is probably what I would have asked you to do anyway. All right. Let's, uh... Heading out. I don't see why I don't just have an army of robots at this point. That might really be the best move. Ammo out. X-ray neutralized. Is that our something dead? Okay. On our way. Maybe we can get some people in there and distract them from the nearly dead fresh meat I've got. Weapon oh, for free. God's sake, not those guys! Uh. <laughs> Tim's totally gonna bleed out. It's my fault! Uh. I wonder... Alright, I'm gonna try something here. Hold on. I got a flamethrower. Those things are invisible and everything, but I mean they've gotta be somewhere, right? Could I flamethrower them? Maybe. Preparing flamethrower. <sighs> that did not work. I am genuinely disappointed that that did not work. I had high hopes. I'm ready. Yeah, I know. We all are. I'm on the move. Oh, this is, this is bad. Dead in the water here. Uh, yeah. That is not good. That is absolutely true. I'm with you 100% on that. Alright. Throw out a chance here. Oh, God. Thank you. Once again, Jay Cockdiesel saves all of our asses. That was unfortunate. Speaking of unfortunate, on the move. They're flanking us. at least we got it out in the open. Back in. Just yeah, just stay on. That's fine. Back in. All right. What do we got? Okay. That fell apart. He's dead. God damn it! What's happening? No, no, this, this isn't I'll right. tell you what's happening. Whoa! Right. Stop oh, yeah. <laughs> Alright. Gwen is a section eight. She has lost her shit. She's firing at us. And I thought I was upset about Tim dying. I mean I was, but clearly Gwenny is, is is not handling it any better than the rest of us. Just hang out and wait for this fucking shadow thing to come out. You just gonna hang out, really? Just gonna wait? Affirmative, Commander. Fucking asshole. Ugh. I hate those things so much. Alright, Cock Diesel, get in there. You're funny, Dad. Yeah, you're doing great. Ms. Pig, you I'm too. Let's. How about we get you inside so you don't have to look at Tim's blood-covered corpse. I should have been a better friend to you, Tim. That one was on old Phil. Target is still standing. Okay. You're gonna do it. Gonna do the strangly thing, huh? It's really your your only move. Let's see if Kayla, you need a you need a kill. 
There you go. Enjoy that. Bye bye. Everything by the numbers. I I can't help but disagree. I mean, you've got an interesting spin on things. That's wonderful. I appreciate it, but that kind of optimism is getting us nowhere. Okay. Jesus. This Gwenny Pig barely made it out alive. She's gonna need half a month to, to get back on track. I offer you no promotions. I offer you an Our Leader's Just Awful medal, which, you know what? Understandable. Totally understanding that. Okay, let me check sure something here. I'm gonna go to the gray market. This is where we can sell count. shit off. Several members of the council have expressed I'm not gonna sell an anything. This damage stuff here we've recovered. However, doesn't do we anything be careful for in choosing what items we release. The research team may not have discovered sell their true that value now. yet. Wow. Okay. We gotta make an alien containment facility. Our worst suspicions may have been true after all. They're not just here for abductions. They have something else in mind. Oh, that's right. We need the power. So we got one more day. As soon as this power generator is good. Power generator. There we go. So now that that's set, we can make... God damn it. All right, 15. We need 15 more monies, I guess. 15 more monies. Um, I don't want to sell anything too important. Those will probably do for now. I'll probably end up selling a lot more shit later on, but for now, when I have so much stuff not researched, it's probably not a terrific idea to sell too much shit. Thank you. Alright, in a week we'll have that. So let's... <laughs> let's see what happens next. I, I, I will be just as surprised as you at this point as to what the next step is. Hey, Miss Druck, we could've used you. Could've used you earlier. Muscle fiber density of LNG. Cool. Leg strength. Reach high... Oh, see, that's not... See, that gene, the genetics lab is so good for some of them. The uh, the sniper in particular, I'm big on that. Um, speaking of sniper, I'm gonna work on this precision laser. I've always thought of science as a way one, to improve our everyday lives, still very to answer cool. the long-standing questions of scientific history. All right, when this council report comes through, we got some shit to buy. Hopefully, some laser guns and oh, good, commander. We're receiving several <laughs> urgent requests for okay, assistance. Okay, we can get a new assault there are marine in here. progress at each marked site on the hologlobe. 200 bucks in Canada, or we could take it easy and get some more scientists. I, uh, I, I'm really into the idea of getting a new assault guy. Assault would be very cool to have at this point. We don't have any of that. Vixen, welcome back to the game. Oh, good. We've got some more people. All right. Welcome to the game, Miss Lord Friedman. From good old-fashioned New England originally. I think she's just up north now. Who the fuck knows anymore? Miss Friedman, welcome to the game. And, of course, the grand old Viking, Mr. John Turner. John, I hope you enjoy the fact that I gave you your blonde beard. I didn't shave your head entirely because I didn't want your serial killer looks to, uh, fuck with the aliens too much. It seems like that would be unfair. And in honor of that, we're gonna give you the art throw. I don't know why we're not. We don't have any place to put them just yet. But I gotta get used to the idea of someone having it. On our way. We're just sticking to Europe mostly. We gotta take care of our own. The next deployment site is in the UK. Panic is spreading throughout a major city as the aliens move through the streets. We have to get a handle on this They're situation. Just going through the streets, doing things, ordering falafel, buying back issues of the Weekly World News. Central, this is Big Sky. Strike. 
enemy team is touching down now. Stay All right. For your orders. Roger, Big Sky. Kick down Maybe that five door. Five. Strike one is the green light for deployment. Huh. All right, Cock Diesel. Get some elevation, there lady. Moving to position. Look who's here. There they go. Good. Good. They're firing lasers and we're firing explosives and ammunition at a gas station. I feel good about this. I feel like we've made strides uh, on the just the level of excellent ideas that we're having. They just keep getting fucking better and better Moving and out. better. Get up there with Miss Cock Diesel, please. That old elevation never hurt nobody. Except for anybody who's ever fallen off a ladder. But beyond that, mostly fun. I like it. You guys see the cars going away in the background there. This war is going on and these people are just going to work. Fuck, I gotta do that presentation tonight, and I don't get paid enough for this shit, and oh my god, look at that, is there aliens shooting lasers at the, at the El Cheapo, is that what the fuck that is? Moving. Ah, that's weird. The gas is up to three dollars a gallon, and I gotta tell you, this is all just fucking stupid. Canister location confirmed. Yay, canister. Miss Cock Diesel. You know what to do. Exactly. All right, good deal. All right, everyone, get find a window. Find a window you like best. Set yourself up here. Position this one isn't so bad, at least. I'm doing okay. Right? <laughs> I'm doing okay, right, guys? <laughs> Christ. Alright, let's head on over to this thing. Going. Thank you. Glad to know you're going. Crystal, I gotta tell you, I've known you for a while, and, uh... Ever since we put you in the robot suit, you've just, you've lost a little of that joie de vivre you had before. Joie de vivre. Maybe it's because you are now a robot. I can't help but feel partially responsible for that. So I want to apologize right now. Excuse me, Crystal, we're gonna, we're gonna hide behind gas pumps to avoid, um, being fired upon. Because if if uh, if we don't get hit, it is preferable that these gas pumps get hit. On the move. That is our thinking. We are geniuses. We are a, a, at least as smart as your average American citizen these days. See, I'm, I'm getting way political. Isn't that beautiful? Aren't you excited about that? I know I am. Good! You know what? I was just thinking. Those disappearing strangle machines... Um, haven't been around in a while. Oh, good! Happy stealth mode time. I've been waiting for that. I, 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 I'm erect and excited. I love happy stealth mode time. It's, it's the best thing in the world. Hold on. Let's, let's get you... Better okay. angle. Last time, um, I had a happy stealth mode time that I enjoyed as Rolling much as out. this one. I was being strangled to death by an alien. And it was, I mean, it was good. It was fun. I, I was just, I was pleased. I think we all were. I think everyone in that Moving. particular camper really enjoyed it. I, I just got that distinct impression. Hey, 
There we go. Threat has been eliminated. Yeah. Yeah. I'm running out of reasons not to just invest entirely in an army of robot people. I got very little to suggest that that's a bad idea. Except for the fact that I can't really heal. I don't know if I've pointed that out yet, but in the game you can't really heal the mech troopers the same way you can uh, heal everybody else. You can repair them, I think, but I don't... Uh, the, the specifics of it escape me. Okay. Oh, good. Well, we seem to be doing fine. I don't see what could possibly... Um, you again. Good. That's good. Heading out. Yeah, in that corner. It's a good corner for all involved. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Hide. Good. I'm gonna uh, attempt to give somebody else some. Uh, Moving. Some experience, because Crystal's just fucking killing it. Of course, he's suppressing us, so we don't have much. I have zero chance to hit this guy. Well, not zero exactly, I have 1% chance to hit that guy. But I think you understand what I was getting at there. I'm not much better in that situation, yeah. To say. You know what? Maybe, maybe, maybe having Crystal on our way over after all isn't such a bad thing. She's getting to the point where I issue her orders and she sounds fucking bored. We're being fired upon. We're all gonna die. And she's like, yeah, fine. Rachel, I want to apologize that I think both battles today, you started to get choked out uh, by a happy stealth time monster. I know that that's really a lot to bear. I apologize for that right off the bat. Time to motor. Okay. And fly by night is fine. He's fine. He's fucking fine. Doesn't matter. None of this matters. He's just grumbling to himself. He has no actual tangible plans. Jesus Christ. Just when you think you're done. Moving out. Let's collect that melon real quick. All right, Miss Cock Diesel. Time for a little elevation. Get you up there. Apparently not. Okay. That's good to know. All right, lining everybody up. They're just sectoids. It's not like they haven't have murdered several members of my team in the past. Well, one. One. I haven't murdered several, to be fair. Let's not get dramatic here. Well done, Miss Freeman. Game. Excellent shot. Come 
Incoming fire. Revenge shots from the alien thing. Good. Miss Cock Diesel. Did you care for a two for one? Oh, Presto Changeo. All right. Excellent work. You're in good shape. Now that complete. was a nice mission. I'm feeling better about myself, ladies and gentlemen. I'm not going to lie. I'm feeling okay. I've lost friends. I've lost co-workers. But you know what? Ultimately, I am alive. And isn't that really what it's all about, ladies and gentlemen? The fact that I, the Conquistador, am alive. And we've got two new support people. Turner and Friedman, both of them. You support. You support. Of course, I'd, n I'd never imagine John Turner as a field medic guy, but you know what? Let's roll with that. I'm good with that. Friedman, you're doing, you're doing great. You're gonna be great. Miss Cock Diesel. Oh yeah, I think, uh, I think we're gonna have to go with that. So. Ladies and gentlemen, we got a holy shit they're shooting award to give out. And Miss Kate Clark, who's an assault, we're going to change remember, her shortly. But we will be before we go, let's bow our head in remembrance of Mr. Tim Reynolds, who died on his first mission, Operation Bloody Paramore, shot by a sectoid. And he didn't even get to shoot back, ladies and gentlemen. He didn't even get to shoot back. Ah. <laughs> <laughs>